Hi guys, it's Matt and this is just a really quick review. Um, I know you hate reviews and I shouldn't review stuff and people think they suck, but still. I ordered some third party mags. Um, these are them. They look similar to P mags, except, oh no, the bottom plate does slide off like a P mag so that's nice I didn't know that that's cool so right that's that's added points in my book now so that's not so bad um, it feels the plastic itself feels a little squishy but I think that's due to having a massive window in the side it's gonna flex in those areas um, and for fit let's use the old Raven, well, the new Raven that I got today as well. So, yeah, mag, and I've noticed they're quite tight and you have to slap them in with some force, otherwise, they'll just fall out. But getting them out is a little easier. They're, I know that the magwell on the Raven is tight, it's a very tight magwell, as is. Um, the strife's a lot better, um, the regulator's reasonably tight, um, Elite Alpha Trooper's not too bad, there's a few blasters that are okay with, with tighter magazines like this and the blaster parts magazines, but, um, I believe Broke Nerfing reviewed, um, the Omeo magazines. The, the straight ones, these are cur slightly curved as you can tell, 12, 12 mags, and I do have some of those Omeo mags that I bought a long time ago, and they're the same ones that Broke Nerfing reviewed, and the plastic on them feels cheaper, um, these, these feel a bit better, they feel more sturdy, than the Omeo ones that I had. The Omeo ones just felt really, really cheap. I might actually have one kicking around here somewhere, but yeah, tomorrow by the Raven. Uh, but no, they're they're very, very cheap. Um, I think four of these was eleven ninety nine, maybe. I'm not sure, but they are very cheap. So, they're cheap magazines. Um, I mean, you're looking at spending £15 on a single Worker 22 now. Um, whereas these are 415s, so that's 412s, sorry. So, that's 48 rounds um, for like just over a tenner. And it does have the nice slide off base plate like the Worker P Mag. So you can put it on a mount, uh, or you can put range of, uh, range of plates on the bottom, so you can have the hook coming out the bottom. Um, the texture on them, nice. If you can hear that, slightly rough, uh, but not painfully rough, just textured. And then this bit is completely smooth, just with which way the dart goes and then an arrow tell you in case you're not that stupid not stupid well too stupid to notice the, the picture tells you where the dart which way the dart goes and how many goes in and that says 12 if I tilt it in the light you can see the 12 but yeah overall not bad They'll be happy in a strife. Um, actually, I have a strife right here. Ta-da! It's a strife. Let's see how the mag fit is on a strife, on a modded strife. Solid. That's that's perfect. The mag fit on that is really nice. It's not likely to drop out. It's not, I mean, even if I press the mag release, they're not going to drop out. 
but they will comfortably slide out without much force you don't have to wrench them out of your blaster but no um yeah i'm gonna get a refund on this i think because if you listen to the motors I think there's a problem. So, yeah. That was nice while it lasted. Nice idea. Poor execution. But still, these, pick them up on Amazon. They're on Prime. So, you'll get them... If you order them in the morning, sometimes you'll get them same day. Sometimes you get them next day. But they're the WYSWYG, W-S-Y-W-Y-G uh, magazines. That's the company, WYSWYG, I believe. Weird name, but still. I think they're attempting to do WYSWYG, but misspelled it for what you see is what you get. But still, this is WYSWYG 12 mags, recommended. They have the nice release plate, as I said. They look like worker P mags. They feel a lot. See, there's, even though I'm squeezing it, it's not really bending and it's not opening. So they're they're a lot they're a lot stouter and there's a lot more strength in them than um, the Omeo ones that I have as well. So I'll be using these. And just occasionally using the Omeo because I have a bag full of magazines and a lot of them are six mags which are useless um, unless you're using them for testing. Um, but these are really cheap and definitely worth it. I mean, for the price of all four of these, you can buy two thirds of a worker P mag. A twenty-two a worker twenty-two. Sorry. So for three of these, four of these is the same. Is is a third of two thirds of the the cost of a worker twenty-two. So effectively, you could have six of these for the same price as a twenty-two mag. That's my thoughts. That's a seriously screwed up Raven. Um, there's my strife. And here's my hands, and I got a paper cut on cardboard. But anyway, um, I hope to see you guys soon. I uh, hope that everybody's cool, and I know that everybody except me is going to be at Foam Fest this weekend because I have no money and can't afford to go to Foam Fest. So, yeah, I can't get the train and afford the games and the uh, and then the accommodation so unfortunately sorry guys won't be there won't be able to do any filming won't be able to do anything really except sit at home and watch how much fun you guys are having so anywho have fun take care wear eye protection nerf on i've been matt don't forget to hit like and subscribe down at the bottom if you haven't subscribed already. And hit the little bell icon and that will give you um, an update when my next video has been uploaded. Uh, things are a bit sporadic at the moment. But I'll, um, I'll be sure to get around to um, a more regular upload um, schedule. So hopefully I've got I've gone on far too long about magazines and all kinds of nonsense. So have a great time. Like, subscribe, hit the bell, and hopefully I'll see you guys very soon. Take care. Bye. Now.